Hello, and thank you for joining the Mobotics webinar for the Industrial Vertical. I would like to introduce the United Kingdom team. We have Frank Graham, our Regional Sales Manager, Ed Smith, our BDM for the southern part of the United Kingdom, Dan Eames, the Technical Project Engineer, and myself, Frank Olson. I'm the Inside Sales Manager for the United Kingdom, and I'm located in Germany. As you've seen in the introductory video, the industrial vertical covers many aspects that require solutions, such as security, physical or just monitoring, access control, fire prevention, even monitoring safety and occupational safety regulations, and also um, processes, uh, production processes. So I'd like to discuss uh, some of these uh, aspects. But before we move on, what are some of the consequences if we do not resolve some of these security issues that I mentioned earlier? It could be loss of life, company assets, even the company's reputation, and especially the company profits. One of the main security requirements, of course, are making sure that only authorized personnel have access to where they are required to be. This does not just include the physical protection, but also the software access. This is where Mobotics excels with our cybersecurity cactus concept. Mobotics offers a sophisticated access control solution with our door station concept. Our CCTV hardware can also play a major part. One of the major fears, of course, is a fire breaking out in anyone's facility. And as the slide describes, it can endanger human lives, disrupt your operations, and uh, material and financial costs could be overwhelming. Um, recently, Mobotics uh, received what's called a VDS certification. This certifies that our M16 range of thermal cameras can be safely impl implemented in any fire prevention concept the company may have devised. We have several uh, thermal solutions. Uh, we have um, companies that are actually using our solution, and I would like to show these uh, here in the uh, next upcoming slides. So the main objective, of course, is to protect people, objects, and of course the machinery that you use for your production. Here you see a picture of our M16 model. On the left you will see a thermal sensor. On the right you will see an optical sensor. The next few slides will demonstrate exactly what these sensors see. Also you notice there is a speaker which can send out an audio signal to announce emergency situations or just uh, talk to the personnel so that emergency measures can be taken. Uh, there's also a PIR sensor and a temperature sensor on the camera. This is the imagery from the M16 which I just showed you. On the left is the optical and of course on the right is the thermal imagery. This is what we call a detect and report fires at an early stage solution. Notice on the thermal imagery, we've set alarm windows. Within these alarm windows, we set temperature parameters. On the second window, you will see that the temperature has reached a critical temperature. It is at this stage that the fire prevention measures kick in. In the small demonstration I just made, there were some positive consequences. The first point, prevent dangers proactively instead of reactively. This helped the fire protection measures to be implemented before the fire could spread. Of course, this then led to reduced risk of business interruptions and of course, fewer unseen costs, which would have been a more financial burden to the company if the fire would have spread. We work with a company called Kuhn Rikon, which has implemented our thermal solutions in their production facility. They had a major fire which caused 4.6 million euros worth of damage, and now they feel much safer that their machinery is being monitored by our thermal solutions. If you would like to have more information about this case study, then feel free to contact me anytime. Every country has some kind of safety and occupational regulation that needs to be followed. Mobotics can actually help monitor some of these uh, regulations. For instance, proper use of machines, uh, safe handling of hazardous materials, or are they wearing hard hats? Uh, we even have apps that uh, have mask detection, 
or monitoring the work time on a machine or monitoring areas, hazardous areas that there's no one supposed to be there. Uh, so Bobotics can actually, through its intelligence software, help companies comply with the safety regulations. I think the lesson to be learned here is just like the slide says, small mistakes, big impact. Prevention is the key. Any small thing can have a major impact on the, on the company's operations. So the key here is early detection. Mobotics can monitor production lines, loading docks. We can even recognize scan codes on, say, pallets. Uh, we can measure temperature of machines before they uh, and deactivate them before an incident occurs. Mobotics has solutions to help people monitor the processes and to make sure that there's a safe environment. Protecting people, which is your most important asset, is the main concern with regards to safety. Mobotics can help monitor the safety areas. We can make sure that people have hard hats on. Even the camera can speak to the person and say, you know, please put on your mask, please put on your uh, safety helmet. You can even restrict zones that when someone goes into a certain zone that's not supposed to be there, you can send out a warning signal or you can have the camera actually talk to the person, uh, warning them uh, that they're in an unsafe area. The intelligence of the camera can help save people's lives. Work-related injuries cost companies $7 billion a year. Mobotics can help reduce those injury costs, not just for as a cost factor, but also as a morale factor. People need to know that they can be safe on the workplace. So four points stand out how Mobotics can help companies monitor internal security processes and safety measures. Basically, uh, employees enjoy a higher safety standard. We can actually trigger automated alarms when a dangerous situation uh, um, occurs. Of course, cost savings through error prevention, meaning less maintenance costs because you find the error quicker. We feel that Mobotics can actually help everyone save money and save lives. We do have a case study, Louis Dreyfus from Belgium, which has implemented every single point that I just discussed in the last few slides. If you need, would like to have more information about this case study, feel free to contact me at any time. Mobotics can also help improve its processes by monitoring of the production steps re with regards to time, temperatures. Uh, we can also control stock movements. We can also monitor uh, the, the machines remotely so that the maintenance personnel will spend less time traveling to a, a piece of equipment. They can just monitor it remotely. So all these steps can lead to one thing, of course, an increase in operational profitability, which is what every company strives for. Let's talk about how Mobotics can increase your operational profitability. Mobotics cameras can be strategically placed along the production line. Each step can be monitored. If there's an error, a notification can be sent to the maintenance personnel. They can then immediately react, thus reducing your downtime. One of the main advantages of Mobotics is the ability to perform maintenance inspections remotely. This reduces the maintenance travel time and the ability for maintenance personnel to inspect more equipment in a shorter amount of time. This has a major impact on operational uh, profitability. Mobotics has several examples of how our solutions can autonomously trigger other alarms or machines to help prevent larger instances occurring. An example is our VDS certification, which are tied into many of the fire uh, prevention measures uh, that many companies have today. So with regards to process monitoring, uh, our innovative uh, mobotics technology has is basically four points, an increased productivity and added value. It's a modern solution in today's environment. 
we can also help reduce production times, cost reduction. The cameras basically pay for themselves. And in the end, of course, you have an increase in pro profitability through the analysis of what Mobotics can provide. Here we have a perfect case study out of New Zealand. 70 cameras monitor production, parking lots, and entry roads. Again, loading docks, pallets, how the people are moving about, basically monitoring the whole production process from loading dock to production. From day one, Mobotics has designed the cameras to work in harsh environments. Some of these harsh conditions are listed here. Our cameras generally work from minus 30 up to 60 degrees. We have many tests done by the TÜV for humidity and moisture testing. Dirt and dust, we have many examples of dust being uh, blown at the camera and the camera still works uh, with no blockage of view. Regarding poor lighting and darkness, you can configure the camera for different exposure settings. Also, we also work with our own um, IR features. With regards to digital industrial espionage, this goes back to our cactus concept, our cybersecurity concept. And Mobotics has, to this day, been able to uphold the standards uh, in the industry for um, espionage cybersecurity related issues. Here you can see a quick synopsis of what I mentioned in the previous slides, that our systems are resistant, robust, and our cybersecurity measures are second to none. We do provide a cybersecurity hardening guide, and this provides tips on how to better secure your system from the router all the way to the camera. And it's a very, very handy guide to have uh, for any kind of uh, solution. Our IoT range has a mean time between failure of over nine years. This is due to the fact that we have no moving parts in our cameras. They're very resilient, and you do not need any additional uh, equipment to cool the cameras. Here you can see our Mobotic 7 series. You'll notice that it is a three modular system. The left and the right are usually used for our optical uh, sensors. You can either have a combination of day-night or day-day or night-night, whatever your solution uh, requires. The third sensor can be used, for example, for a, an audio module with a microphone and a speaker. The most important aspect of the camera, though, is the intelligence, the new chipset that is a part of the M7 solutions. The camera is loaded with applications already preloaded onto the camera. They just need to be activated through a licensing process. This I've already mentioned a, a few times in the presentation. However, what I did not mention is that we do hire companies to what we call conduct a penetration test. Uh, and we receive a certification to make sure that we are actually up to date with our standards and we know that we are second to none in, in the industry with our cybersecurity measures. So keeping in line with what we just talked about in the last few slides, here are four key points with regards to our hardware. We've talked to many customers uh, throughout the last 20 years, and they've all been very satisfied with the durability and the robustness of our cameras. Uh, cybersecurity, I'm not going to be getting into anymore because that we've already proven this. Uh, what does all this do? Basically, it saves you money. Uh, the less cameras you need and the less you need to maintain them and they still function, this is a cost-saving operational cost for everyone. Here's a case study that you can also find online that exemplifies what I just mentioned to you about our hardware. Bieber and Marburg have 47 all-around dual-night cameras that work in temperatures of standard temperatures at minus 25 degrees Celsius. If you'd like more information about this case study, feel free to contact me and I'll make sure that you get more information. I would just like to quickly mention that we have a solution for any requirements that you do have in the industrial vertical, uh, be them outdoor, indoor, maybe with thermal applications, also access control. We do have a supplemental move line, uh, which basically supplements our IoT selection. With this slide here, you can review some of the main features of our outdoor, indoor, thermal, complementary move line, and the excess control, and basically what they were designed for. 
Here you can see applications that we feel are important to the industrial vertical. These applications are preloaded onto the 7 Series cameras. You activate these applications through a licensing program. The Amex Analytics AI and the Activity Sensor AI are a free version which do not require any activation codes. I hope I was able to demonstrate some of the benefits that Mobotics can provide for you in the industrial vertical. Of course here, number one, ensure security at all levels. That goes from safety and occupational compliance regulations all the way down to your preventive measures just in case there's an event that does happen. Of course, in increasing your profitability. Uh, this is an important uh, fact for your stockholders or, and for the company in general. Of course, reinforce your quality and your image. Mobotics is a very modern system, a very intelligent system, and is very scalable for the future. And simplify your life and that of your employees. We're easy to use. Once the system is set up, anyone can basically use it, which saves a lot of money on training. And uh, it's, again, I, just like I said, it's scalable for the future, and it just makes things a lot easier. Thank you for listening to the webinar. You can contact me at frank.olson at mobotics.com. If you'd like a demonstration of our products, feel free to contact me, and we will make sure we set up a demo for you. If you need it for more information regarding case studies, certifications, never hesitate to contact me. We'll, we will make sure that you receive that information. I wish you all a very successful day. Until next time, thank you.